Hi, I'm Olivia. Is it, what is this, granite? It's stupid. It looks dirty no matter what you do. Like, I don't know if this here, no, it looks like dirt. No, it's not. It's totally clean. Apparently, I'm the only one that hates this. The awesome thing about kitchen tech is that it's something that makes our lives better and it also improves the lives of people with disabilities. So I'm finishing my coffee, like for real, this is not rehearsed. Post in the comments what your favorite coffee is. Coffee is one of my main food groups and it has been for a long time. And now we're gonna talk about air fryers. Oh, I have to unplug you to show you to the people. Ugh. Come here, big boy. Oh my God. This here is my new wave air fryer that I got for Christmas. It was not gifted to me by the company. They don't know I exist. It's cool because it has this drawer that goes in and out and it actually, you don't have to click anything. It comes with this like platform, which I haven't used yet. This is removable inside. This machine can save, I think like a hundred presets. And these are considered the most important ones. And this is why I think this air fryer is so awesome because it has a pop tart setting. The makers of this machine thought that pop tart was more important than toast. And actually, yes, it is. Well, my collection of capybaras seems to have already provided a pop tart for us to try. Here we go. Pop-Tart, air fryer. Okay, gotta put you down and open the Pop-Tart. No, I feel like I got the, the Pop-Tart that is like at the end of the, the thing, kind of like when the ink runs out. It's clearly made correctly. I actually think it would be tastier with less icing. So I'm actually not mad about this. I'm literally putting the tripod down my pants. Yeah, the tripod is in my pants, you guys. Because I can't hold, see, I have two hands and the tripod is in my pants. So we're going to like make this happen. I'm gonna stand on my tippy toes. Come on, pants camera. Okay, so I'm gonna put this in here. I guess I'll just put it on the bottom because I could put it on this and, and do it, but. I think I want to do it in the most easy way possible because that's how I roll. Now we're going to close it. I'm going to take the tripod out of my pants. I'm going to hit power. Pop tart is setting 19. So we're going to do menu and we're going to go all the way up to 19. Now we're going to hit start and see what happens. Ever since I got my eyesight, I've been like, you know, woo, Pop-Tart. I mean, that, that's how I approach every aspect of life. I actually recommend it. It's pretty fun. In the meantime, while this is doing whatever that is, I am going to give the Pop-Tarts back to my lovely capybara family. It's making sounds now. It started beeping. Aha. There's two minutes left. So I have two minutes to hang out with you guys. Let me introduce you. This one is Percival. This one is Century Cappy. This one is Coffee or Cooking Cappy. And this one is Cappy. They are nice. I mean, I think it's as done as I want it to be. They're gonna Turn this off. Now I'm gonna get the pop tart out. Oh wait, I need to do pants camera again. Pants camera, get in there. Okay, pants camera. Uh -uh, is it hot? Is it hot? It's kind of hot. And I, I snapped it a little bit in half because I, I really didn't use good cooking methods today. Intentionally, pants camera take pants camera out of pants. All right, so now I'm gonna try the pop tart and I'm gonna see, I'm gonna have a taste and see if it's any good. This is actually amazing. Even though this looks kind of strange, 
what this seems to have done is like almost caramelized the sugar on the top of it. It's something that doesn't happen when you toast it, I don't think. Not that I'm an expert. And on a serious note, I really do love my Christmas gift. My new way of air fryer, I, I don't have a toaster and I don't have a lot of counter space. So I use it as a toaster, as an air fryer. I have an oven and technically you don't need an air fryer if you have an oven but it really speeds up the cooking time on pretty much everything that I do. That didn't even leave any crumbs, so I'm not even gonna have to clean it, but it is really easy to clean. I've been using my air fryer for about a month now to make usually marinated chicken for dinner or you know roasted vegetables. It comes out perfect every time. I really like this air fryer. It's I think it's like under a hundred bucks or just around a hundred bucks maybe a little over and I, you know, but in the case of things like air fryers, these are things that people know make people's lives easier. And that's what we should be using technology for. A cookie and a pie all in one. Now that this is clean, even though this is still stuck here and I probably am gonna need to call the, the I don't know, the police to, to get that out of there.